Hello. Hello. video let us tell you our story about our vacation visit some museum in Jakarta so let's get started when we go to the museum we use Transjakarta hello guys may I introduce myself to you uh, my name is Sofya Nelinda and this is my friend my name is Yoga Narendra uh, and now we are in Museum Nasional Jakarta <laughs> Indonesia is an archaeological, historical, ethnological, and geographical museum. In the museum, we can see so many historical objects. By the way, why so many people say the National Museum as Gedung Gajah? Because of the bronze elephant statue in the front yard. The museum was official open in 1868 and popularly known as Gedung Gajah or Gedung Arca. The museum has a collection of 61,000 prehistoric and anthropological artifacts and 5,000 archaeological artifacts from all over Indonesia and Asia. In September 2013, Four precious golden artifacts stolen from the museum. Yep, very unfortunately, that the artifact can be stolen by people who are not responsible. By the way, in the museum, I see one of the objects I think very interesting. The biggest one, Acha Baywara, it is very interesting too, because it is very historical for Hindu and Buddha. So that is our trip to the National Museum of Jakarta and the next trip is Hello guys, after Andrea and Ellen goes to Museum National No, me and my friend are going to Wait, 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 where is we going? Bank Indonesia lah What is Bank Indonesia? Why don't we go now? Yeah, that's okay Let's go! October 1827, Indonesia has been colonized by Manila. They built a bank in Batavia with name the Jeffers Bank. The bank was built to increase the economic government in the Netherlands after the freedom of Indonesia. The Jeffers Bank has been nationalism and changed its name into Bank Indonesia. Indonesian Bank Museum very clean and well maintained. Yes, that's right. This is the best and the most modern museum in Jakarta. 
in the museum, we can see public Indonesian bank or in Indonesian history. Such as monetary policies and payment system that change over time. The museum also provides visitors with audio and visual experience on the history of currents and trade in Indonesia from pre-colonial era to the present state. We will also see a visual when the Dutch doing transactions. We can also see the picture of our Indonesian bank really. Well, in the museum we can see gold bar simulation. This is our trip video. Thank you for watching us. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. Bye. Thank you for watching. Bye!